welcome this is the energy vibration reading for the Aries Sun Moon and Rising it is the week it is the week of um, it's a positive week it is the week of um, justice and the week begins from the 9th until the 15th I want to say thank you for being here thank you for being back let's look and see what you Aries have for this week this week is going to be um, the zodiac energy of fire because we're still in your birthday zodiac okay so let's see for this week for the Aries you have uh, the energy of um, the eight of wands message is going to be coming to you on Monday um, so let's see what's happening for you on Tuesday um, you have uh, you're finding your true light your true self again and this is going to be good because we have the angman in the reverse form which is wonderful on Wednesday we have the seven of cups there's a lot of new opportunities and openings that are coming for you guys then we have uh, um, the three of ones working together um, and uh, um, trying to leave something behind and moving forward in your life in a positive positive way on Friday we have uh, the energy of the eight of swords you are seeing a situation for what it is and you are trying to move away from a situation and then we have the ace of of Pentacles which is a wonderful energies that is coming in on Saturday a lot of people seems to be receiving the energy of the ace of Pentacles and on Sunday you have inner strength okay so it is a week of resting for you guys um, this is what is coming up that you need to rest in this week so um, let's see what is happening with uh, the fire energy which is good on Monday and on Tuesday with the energy of uh, light you're finding your true inner strength again you have the ace of Pentacles so this is wonderful so news is going to be coming to you about money and this is in a very positive way this could be money that you should have received that is coming out for you so center of the week is that you have the energy of uh, the king the knight of wands this is someone who is an Aries and Leo is Sagittarius so for you um, men and women um, 18 until 30 it's going to be wonderful news about your financial situation coming in in the middle the beginning of the week middle of the week we have your wishes and your dreams coming true so wonderful energies are going to be coming out for you guys wonderful situation is going to be happening and then you have the energy of the six of cups so whatever the situation that you were having with family and that sort of a thing with money it's going to be returned to you if uh, say um, you your family had borrowed money from you and, and did not return this money it is going to come through in the middle of the week so um, this is wonderful because the energy of the nine of cups and uh, um, the six of cup that means is uh, an inheritance for some people or it's just money that was lent out to a family member um, that they are going to be returning this money to you okay so this is going to be good um, the energy of your own energy is here at the end of the week um, this is uh, the energy of there is a lot of things that are going to be happening for you a lot of people are leaving um, you know certain situations behind but the energy of the um, your own energy vibration is here at the end of the week and this is going to be positive because what is going to be transpiring and what is going to be happening um, good things are going to be coming out you have the seven of um, once this is a situation with work so some people will be working it's like new opportunities are going to be coming your way and these are going to be positive new opportunities so inner strength is here and it's going to be good a lot of new possibilities are going to be coming in for you guys it's a week of um, healing a family situation and if there was a sense of uh, um, money that was taken from you or uh, money that was not paid out to you this is going to be coming in 
in the first half of the week and um, um, especially for you young people it's gonna be positive because if you were looking for a loan or an investment or support to get um, there's gonna be a lot of networking that is going to be happening okay so this is um, very wonderful and very positive the nine of ones is that you're being protected against whatever negativity that is coming at you okay and this is good because you have two nines in this reading so it's going to be a very performed spiritual week because some of you um, the energies that you have you have um, the major arcana of uh, um, the angman in reverse which is a positive positive energies and with these energies that are coming up it's, it's going to be good because in the middle of the week it's all about love it's all about you connecting with family member or, or or and past situations and these are are, are you know uh, they're taking times but they're healing they're healing and um some of you wishes and dreams are going to be coming through which you can see here especially for the younger people in the beginning of the week this is um a very positive situation for you guys at the beginning of the week whatever situations that was happening and you weren't aware or you um, had no control over this is coming to an end and positive energy so you have the ace of Pentacles and the six of cups ace of Pentacles and the six of cups it could be that um, a reunion an ex-lover or someone you knew from your past is coming back and this is going to bring you a new start in your financial world this is going to be wonderful because um, the aces are always gift from the universe so this could be that a family situation that has been a rare for um a, a certain time that it is now coming in balance and you will see this happening to you in the middle of the week because you have the ace of pentacles and the six of cups so obviously um some people are going to be realizing that um maybe a family has left you in lore that you weren't aware of and this is going to be coming in to you um, the, the, the inner strength you have you know don't worry about this inner strength and don't worry about what is happening because it's going to be healing and transforming in your life money is not going to be a problem if money is a problem all you have to do is call upon the universe and ask the universal angels and guides to help you but right as you can see this is as a family um, support from family is going to be coming in the energy that you you receive from the the consciousness spirits angels and guides it says um, the flame of wisdom the crowning of the flame of wisdom I've been guided to look back because there is another message for someone out there whoever you are that has been feeling trapped you are going to release yourself out of this trapped feeling you're going to start living again because what is happening is that a, a whole lot of message and communication is going to come at you and you're going to um, realize that you're not trapped you need to just pull yourself out and find your your normal energy who you are your inner strength and this is going to be help in the middle of the week it's going to be wonderful because some of you wishes and dreams are going to be coming through with this energy it says I am open to all of life wisdom and share it with gratitude so open up yourself to all the life wisdom and uh, and share it with gratitude okay if you have a question you can ask your question now I'm working with the angels answers and the answer to your question is there a big happy change is coming in for you so this is so wonderful so good because you're still vibrating in your energy vibration of this week and this is going to be a very positive so a big happy change is coming in for you so celebrate this week this week is a week of celebration for you guys because whenever the energy of big happy changes is coming in if you were going through any sort of a situation it's as if your guides and angels are um, orchestrating something very very um, uh, good for you it's always a big positive change um, in relationships and work in career in business in your personal life there's big happy changes so if there was a situation with your family and that sort of a thing you may find yourself on a new career part or entering a new relationship 
So this is it. When these big epic changes, always new career parts or, you know, um, if you're looking for a new home or a new place to live, this is going to be happening for you in this week. Embrace these um, exciting new changes that are coming in and know that your angel will be you with you all the way to support you through the, this um, changes because it's going to be a big positive change. What you're asking about um, may require a leap of faith. So take a leap of faith. You know, sometimes you need to bring out certain things in your life. You just need to take a leap of faith. Don't be frightened. Trust the opportunities before you because they were meant to bring you happiness. These opportunities would not have represent themselves if it wasn't meant for you. Release your fear and Follow your heart in this week because it's going to take you to positive place. I want to say, um, please listen to your sun, moon, and rising sign. I love you, Aries. I love you so much. Um, <laughs> my cousin called me last week to say, oh, it was my birthday and you never said happy birthday. And I was like, oh, my baby. You know, and, um, you know, just enjoy um, yourself because this is going to be a fabulous year for you, Aries. I want to say um, go and listen to the third, the second quarter reading because this is the reading from the month of April until June. There is a lot of information that is in that reading that can connect with the month of June reading. So listen to the third quarter reading and then listen again to your month reading because there's a lot of information that you're going to receive this is going to be a positive week for you guys so enjoy your week until next week namaste